hi in this tutorial we are start from where we have left in our previous tutorial so first open netbeans and we will now make display student page dot blade dot php file so open this file and delete the default code that is there in the file so we will start by typing html tag and a closing html tag inside the html tag we will type header tag and a closing header tag that is less than sign head and greater than sign and then less than sign forward slash head and greater than sign inside the header tag we will type a op, uh, title tag and a closing title tag inside the title tag we will type the title that is display student below the title tag below the closing title tag we will type h1 tag and a closing h1 tag uh, inside the h1 tag we will type display students from database that will display in our html page view page below that is our closing header tag below the closing header tag we will type our body tag and a closing body tag so we type our body tag that is less than sign body and greater than sign and then closing body tag that is less than sign forward slash body and greater than sign inside the body tag we will type table tag and a closing table tag we will make a table that will contain our data inside the table tag we will type table header tag that is t head tag that is less than sign t head greater than sign and then less than sign forward slash t head greater than sign inside the t head tag we will type table header that is th tag and a closing th tag in the first th tag we will type serial number that is s space no dot and now we will type a second th tag and a closing th tag inside the second th tag we will type student space name that is student name in the third then we will type th uh, tag third time and a closing th tag inside the third th tag we will type student space age that is student age then we will type fourth th tag and a closing th tag inside that we will type class space teacher that is class teacher so we have four headings in our table header that is serial number student name student age and class teacher now we will type that is this is our table headings now we will type t body that is table body tag and a closing t body tag inside the t body tag we will type at for bracket start dollar i equal to 1 semicolon dollar i less than equal to db two colons table bracket start single quote start students single quote and bracket close hyphen greater than sign count bracket start bracket close semicolon dollar i plus plus bracket close then a table row tag that is less than sign tr greater than sign then a php tag that is less than sign question mark php then dollar result equal to db double colon table less than uh, bracket open single quotes students single quotes and bracket close hyphen greater than sign where bracket open single quotes students underscore id bracket close student underscore id comma single quotes start equal to single quotes and comma 
डॉलर आई ब्रैकेट क्लोज हाइफन ग्रेटर देन साइन गेट ब्रैकेट स्टार्ट ब्रैकेट क्लोज देन स्पेस क्वेश्चन मार्क ग्रेटर देन साइन दैट इज क्लोजिंग पी एच पी टैग देन वी विल टाइप टी डी टैग दैट इज टेबल डाटा टैग दैट इज लेस देन साइन टी डी ग्रेटर देन साइन एंड अ क्लोजिंग टी डी टैग दैट इज लेस देन साइन फॉरवर्ड स्लैश टी डी ग्रेटर देन साइन इन साइड द टी डी टैग वी विल टाइप टू ओपनिंग फ्लावर ब्रैकेट एंड क्लोजिंग फ्लावर ब्रैकेट इन साइड द फ्लावर ब्रैकेट वी विल टाइप डॉलर रिजल्ट इन स्क्वायर ब्रैकेट जीरो देन आईफन ग्रेटर देन साइन स्टूडेंट अंडर स्कोर आई डी देन वी विल टाइप टाइप वी हैव टू टाइप और फोर मोर वेरिएबल सो विल वी विल टाइप टी डी एंड अ क्लोजिंग टी डी टाइप टी डी टाइप फोर टाइम्स इन फोर रोज देन वी विल टाइप टू ओपनिंग फ्लावर ब्रैकेट्स एंड क्लोजिंग फ्लावर ब्रैकेट दैट इन साइड दैट वी विल टाइप डॉलर रिजल्ट इन स्क्वायर ब्रैकेट zero then hyphen greater than sign students underscore name then in the third line we will type dollar result in a square bracket zero hyphen greater than sign students underscore class then in the fourth line we will type dollar result in a square bracket zero hyphen greater than sign students underscore age then in the fifth line we will type dollar result in square bracket zero hyphen greater than sign class underscore teacher then there is a closing table row tag that is less than sign forward slash tr greater than sign below that there is at the rate and for then there is a closing body t body tag then there is a closing t table tag then there is closing body tag then there is a closing html tag so this is our display students page blade dot blade dot php file now we will type the root for this so in the roots php file we will type root double colon get bracket start in single quotes we will type forward slash display students single quotes and comma function bracket start bracket close flower bracket start return view bracket start this uh, single quotes start display student page single quotes and bracket close semicolon flower bracket close bracket close end it with a semicolon so this is our root now we will check in browser what does this display so in the browser first we will check our students table what is the data in our students table so we will click in browse in front of our students table so this is the data now we will type our root name that is display students and hit the enter key so as the data is displayed correctly so if you like our tutorial please give it a thumbs up if you have any questions please write in comments if you want to see our more videos please subscribe to our channel thank you